Yep. Ron Cousineau is that important that he has to protect the capital. The fucking capital. Damn. Damn. Yeah, this is really not no nothing important. Eh, uh, they're just telling you, go on, scram, protect the nation's health, and then the elderly tree has a spaz attack and dies. What the brown? It just went Arrgh! like, like like an old guy just dying. Shall we be off, Deus, to the land we're sworn to protect, the capital. First, let's get some sh fish. Mmm, loves me that sushi. So we leave, now we're outside of the magical shrine. That's the prelude, over. Name the shrine, Shinoda. Goto led Raido to a lonely out-of-the-way shrine. It's been a while since you and me came to Shinoda, hasn't it, Deus? Looks like the name of the shrine hasn't changed one bit. I'm sure you don't need a refresher course, Deus, but... You remember why this itty bitty shrine out in the middle of nowhere is so important, right? It's how devil summoners are able to stay in contact with the Yatagarasu. You can bet your to the bottom your bottom yen we'll be seeing a lot of this place. We'll hash out the details later. I'll let you know what we need to do once it comes up. For now, Deus, just go. Just fuck it. Yeah. Yes, now we get to meet the magical girl. Ring the bell and she gets summoned. The music in this game is so, like, peaceful, I should say. It's peaceful and exciting at the same time. The hooded woman. Magical girl! The Herald. Yes, the Herald of the Yatagrasu. Yes. We thank you for traveling to the name of Shrine. In buttholes, Kuznoa village, as the Yatagrasu wills it. We need an existence. You have received word from the Yatagrasu that there is turbulence within the capital. Yes, something is happening within the in the capital that is very, very bad. Agreement. Kuzno will help. Will, helps. Will. Uh, will. Fuck! Can't read. Radu Kuzuno the 40th, and you as well, Goto Doji. This is your assignment. Find the source of this disturbance in the capital and destroy it. The source of the disturbance in the capital? Well, this will not be a short or easy operation. Hence, we have procured a base of operations for you. You will carry this work out from Yurai Ku in the capital, specifically from the location in Sukoto Cho, district of Yurai Ku. A friend of the Yatakurasu resides in there. Sukoto Cho. In Yaraku. Ah! I see where this is going! <laughs> Whee! The Narumi Detective Agency in Sakoto Cho. That place is gonna be your bum buddy for the entirety of the game. Its founder has consented to its use as your base of operations. He is known to the Yatagrasu and to you. He will aid you in this task. In the name of the Yatagrasu, we entrust the fate of the capital to you. Much is, is, uh, uh, much is expected of you, Raido Kuzunawa the 14th. They could have just put like the IV, or um, like X, V, no, IV, XV, XIV, that's it. The Temperance Arcana. The Narumi Detective Agency in Sakoto Cho. Him, again. I found memories of the guy, but I don't know about this. It could get airy. Ah, well. I have to say, it's been a while since our last team-up. I'm sure he's matured, right? Come, Dex. De I mean, Deus. Let's head over to Skorocho and pay a visit to the Nurmi Detective Agency. Save. The end of one chapter. My first one, new cycle, because I normally have two saves whenever I play a game. That's Donifer's. That's Uchiha's. He started playing the game... We went four hours in. So, uh, proceed next chapter. Indeed, I would enjoy to go to the next. Enjoy going to the next chapter. Stop the fretful baby's wail. Take from the earth the moon so pale.
pale. Feed the baby his meal frail. There's more. Hold on. Oh, come on now. There's supposed to be a lot more than that. At least I remember. The Taisho era, 20. Year 20. Of course, nowadays, everyone adopts the old European way of doing things. AD and BC. So, it's probably... The time period right now would be about... Uh, 19? <laughs> 19 no they're cars and it was just after world war two so probably like 1957 it was when doc mr dr crowley the dude was still around ma in the sky is waiting is watching you <laughs> when the sky is pierced right through you'll sleep at Great Ma's bosom, too. And here comes Rido's first assignment. Hell's that? There's some weird demons, I guess. Some guardian statues. Nigga, I cannot read that for shit. I cannot read katakana. I'm kind of blanking on the rest of the story for this game. I remember we have to fight Abaddon. That was that if you've watched the um, video I made of beating this game. If you fight Abaddon in all three of his forms. I got the law ending, so I think this time through I'm going to get the... I'm going to try to get the chaos ending. Did you hear about the girl who returned all the lost wallets? Heard she actually goes to our school. Oh great, that rumor bullshit that started in Persona 2. And Persona 4 for that matter as well. How humanity doesn't want to exist within the world of reality and rather subjugate themselves to the fantasy they create with their words and beliefs, and misguided beliefs. 13 wallets in one day, I wonder how many shortcakes a girl could buy with that kind of do what the fuck? Chubby schoolgirl. Oh, now I'm jealous. No one's luck is that good. On the other hand, that means there were 13 other people, all of whom lost their wallets. 13 people losing their wallets in the same neighborhood? All in one day? I don't think anyone's luck is that bad either. Now this game, pay attention to luck. Luck is a very important thing in this game. It's kind of centered around the idea of fortune and misfortune. The man with the pole on his back talked to a mother and a child. I thought I'd do the modern thing and get some bread at the department store on my day off. The gentle ice vendor. So I was in the cafeteria line ready to order when suddenly I got a whooper of a belly ache. Of all the luck, huh? It might not have been as bad as you think. Don't you see the paper this morning? I mean, didn't you see the paper this morning? Something terrible has happened in the cafeteria. A cook accidentally dropped a button into the dough. Customer ate the whole roll and had to be carted off to a hospital. Holy shit, well, glad I wasn't that motherfucker. Glad I didn't go to the cafeteria. Ah. Golly. Golly. <laughs> Golly. Oh, that's some like shit out of a 1930s cartoon. So that couldn't have, could have been me laid up in the hospital. Well, I guess it was a lucky thing I had the stomach ache in time, eh? Eh? Say, since you're here, would you like some ice? Maybe so, my throat's parched from talking so much. I'll take two. Bitch, you only said like 
two sentences. What, why, ever not? What, why, ever not? Oh, great. Country Hicks. Cause, cause there's a button inside it. Ah, oh, oh, you. Uh, I'll slap you later. I'll fucking take you to the, take you to the spanking rack. And beat you senseless. Boy. Alright. Mysterious girl. In this building, it must be the place. The Naomi Detective Agency. And this place doesn't go out of business in Persona th in Persona 2. It's still around. And I think it actually changed its name to the Kuzunoa Detective Agency as well. Don't let the fretful baby cry. Mal cut you to shreds and you'll die. Mal rip your rip you apart and you'll die. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if someone cut me to shreds, I would die, and if I got ripped apart, I would also die. But wouldn't that also entail the same thing, cutting into shreds and ripping apart? They're pretty much the same thing. So that poem is just a little bit redundant. More katakana and kanji that I can't read for shit. Because I'm not Japanese. There he is. Big old boss man. He likes his toast. I think he has like a stack of ten. Or a really big stack. Five slices. Five slices of toast. This motherfucker likes his toast. Toast and butter. It's been a few days since the two of us got word that at Kuzunawa Village to protect the capital. In order for us devil, devil summoners to do our duty, we have basic necessities like lodgings and a base of operations, which the Atigarasu arranges for us. And arranges them in style. This Ginro Kaku building is the biggest and newest in Sakura Cho. A lot of swanky outfits fill these offices, and the Naomi Detective Agency here is one of them. One of M. Well, we will be leave, living with an agent of the Yatograsu. It comes with the th with the th 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 with the territory, which means the Yatograsu will always have an eye on us. I worried about De Deus at first, but then again, and I probably should have mentioned this already. I doubt this agent agent will give us any trouble. Good old Narumi. Hmm? What's that stare, Goto? Ah, I see you've finally taken shine to me, have you? I have a natural way with animals and ladies. Mm. Meow. Don't just stand there, Rido. Come over here with Goto. I made some coffee. Why don't we all have a drink together? It's my own special Narumi blend. It's good to see the three of us working together again. Let's have a toast. To our reunion, a coffee toast. Ha! It's it's funny because he's eating toast and coffee. Uh, fuck you! Hey, Rido. You probably already know this, but you can relax here. No. Take your shirt off. Take your pants off. Nobody can see. We do a lot of things. Don't worry about the cat. He'll get out of this too. Sure, I've got orders from the Yatagrasu, but watch out to watch over you. But meow. You're still young. You've been training at the sum training as a summoner at Kuzunoa Village ever since you were a tyke. Oh yeah, I should probably explain. That cat 